Phil Germo, the LLC Facilities Manager, and I'm here today to give an update of the progress of the LLC office project that was first introduced by Jim Fronty a few weeks ago. We are currently in a due diligence period for this office space that became available to us at 212 West 3rd Street in downtown Monticello. The location of this is about five miles north of the Monticello Church and the Silver Springs property as a point of reference. During the due diligence period, we've had the opportunity to do cost estimates. We have spent a lot of time on a layout, and this layout has given us the opportunity to um, really evaluate what our needs for the LLC office are, and we've identified seven key operational areas. Those seven operational areas are the bookstore, conference rooms, offices, recording, archives, shipping, and kitchen. Now I'll touch on a, a few of those items in review. So in the bookstore area, we intend to uh, make it a little bit more of an inviting location where there would be a place for uh, patrons to sit. The location of the office is in downtown Monticello, so it's more centrally located to a lot of the believers, but also we are hoping that walk-in traffic would also be attracted to come and look at some of the products we have available and maybe purchase some of them for their own personal use. We will also have a number of conference rooms based on the size of the program that we would have available, but they'll be for workshops, seminars. The recording rooms will be used for recording Sunday school programs, uh, preparation for radio programs for winter and summer services, and other audio production projects that we, are, that we have in the works. The offices will be configured in a way that there will be collaborative workspaces for the two different main functions in the office. One is a primary function is, is admin, and that makes up the executive director, facilities manager, the finance manager, and the pastoral committee. The other section of the offices will be set up and designed more for a collaborative work environment for the communications staff. Communication staff is involved with the Voice of Zion, the Shepherd's Voice, musical recordings, musical productions, and uh, the like. We are also including in the office space the, an archive area, which will be similar to what we currently have, which stores a number of written material from uh, different servants from years gone by, but also books that have been donated to the LLC that, have, that are of particular interest in preserving them, such as uh, really old war Bibles and the such. We also have a shipping area that will be incorporated into our office space, and the shipping area is used for shipping of LLC materials throughout North American Zion to the different congregations that have ordered them and for individual orders that come in on the online bookstore. Finally, we will also have a kitchen. The kitchen area will be for serving uh, meeting attendees and for day-to-day -day operations. This project is expected to take about three months, and so our closing date is tentatively scheduled right now for February 3rd. And so from February 3rd, we should be able to get, you know, hopefully get our permits in uh, back by the middle of February and be able to begin construction. There's lots of volunteers that have volunteered to assist in the building of this project and we are looking forward to that uh, donation of labor. And as we already mentioned earlier in this uh, video, it's so important for the success of the LLC and its operations, the volunteer, volunteers and their efforts are, are so important in all aspects of the work. As with all LLC projects, success will come from the generous support of LLC membership. During discussions of this project thus far, we have seen the generous outpouring of support for this project and for all of the LLC projects. If you wish to make a monetary contribution for this project, please go to the LLC website, llchurch.org forward slash donate. 
Once there, you can choose LLC Office Building Project in the drop-down menu on this, on this page. We thank you in advance for your gift. Your love and support are essential. Without it, the work in God's kingdom would be in vain. As in all of the work in God's kingdom, we realize the need for his guidance and blessing. We pray that God will guide this endeavor and all will be done according to his will for his honor and the building up of his kingdom. Please remember this and all the work and the workers in your prayers. Amen.